We are getting our first big major tattoo. Eight hours later. We almost halfway done, guys. It's beautiful and it's not even all the way done. He's going into depth, into detail. We're just getting these first two roses done and then we'll get the back roses done a different time. He's going to get me Taco Bell right now. So nice of him. It's been over an eight hour session today. So it's gonna be about nine and a half hours by the time he's done. We're about to head to our session to finish the rest of it today. So this is the before. There's gonna be some on the back and then finishing that rose in the front. The owner of True Culture Tattoo. Yeah. He's really good at what he does. Approximately 10 hours later. This is where we're at right now. Now he's working on the back part. We're gonna do that in just a second. Alright, boys. We finished the roses. Cool. It's a long session. 10 hours. <laughs> Slick killed it though. So it's almost been a week since I got the rest of my half sleeve. It's already been Christmas. I've almost had this Santa Derm on for about a week. Okay, something that they don't tell you is that it freaking stinks so bad. When you sweat, it just keeps all of it in there. The smell builds up. So, love that. Yeah. Right here, it opened up a little bit. And it's coming off, but it's like starting to kind of dry. It's in the healing process right now. <laughs> yes, we are taking this off because I cannot handle the smell and I cannot handle this on here anymore. This would be a good ASMR video. <laughs> that feels so good. Why is that so satisfying? healing process. I love the 555s. It is all nice and clean. Look at how kind of shiny it looks. I haven't even put any ointment on it either. If any of you are wondering what I use to clean it, I use this Dial Gold antibacterial soap. This stuff is bomb. So this is the end result of my tattoo. It's been a few weeks 
since I've gotten it done, but it's healed so well. My tattoo artist didn't have a heavy hand. He had a very light hand, so like you can't feel it. It feels like baby smooth and no scarring. The roses actually kind of healed a little bit of a lighter, like gray color. He did use like gray tones instead of just black and white. He did use some gray in the roses and then for the background he used black. The reason why I did roses was because it's my favorite flower. I love roses. And my favorite color is red, so <laughs> only makes sense. The angel numbers are something that I see all the time. For me, it's a sense of guidance throughout my day, throughout my life. The one that I have right here on my collarbone is 333. For me, is guidance from my spirit guides. People that are up there watching over me, they're right by my side in that moment when I see 333. 1111. This for me is manifestation. I make a wish every single time I see this number. This one is 222. It means right place, right time. This was a huge one. I got in a pretty bad car accident and that night I saw 222. I have 444. That means the world is protecting you. So whenever you see this number, it just means that you have protection. You know, you're being protected at that very moment. I love 555. So 555 means change. Change is coming. Whenever you see these numbers, get ready for change. The other one on the back, I have 111, which I should have started with that one because duh, it's 111. But 111 is intuition. So whenever you see this number, it assures you on your intuition. So whatever you're thinking about in that moment, listen to your intuition, listen to your gut. Being very in tune with yourself is so important. Last one, I have 777, and that is for good luck. Whenever you see that, it's the lucky number seven. All these numbers are things that I see all the time, throughout my day, throughout my week. Every time I look at the clock to look at the time, I see angel numbers. It's just crazy. I'm so happy with it. My tattoo artist, his name is Tattoo Slick. <laughs> and he did such a good job. So very detailed. It did take a long time. It did. But then again, you can't rush a masterpiece. You can't rush good quality. That is my half sleeve tattoo. So thank you again for coming along on this tattoo journey with me. Until next time.